New this hour, six children left alone without water, diapers or any substantial food. Now their mother is facing charges. Police say they found her drunk with cocaine in her purse. It's a sad story, but thankfully one of those children was able to get some help. Eyewitness News reporter Ken Lemon went to the family's home in Shelby today where the mother is already out of jail. Ken? Yeah, she is out, not interested in talking. Her father, though, did tell me uh, that that this was a mistake and it will never happen again. He also says that the children adore their mother. Now, social workers are trying to determine if they should be reunited. Monday night, the oldest of six children picked up the phone and called his grandmother. The 11 year old said they were scared home alone for about four hours with no running water. The grandmother called 911. Any water, anything. I need help. The grandmother got in a car and started towards a home on Green Oaks Drive in South Shelby. They all in the house by themselves. I just laid it up here, but y'all need to come and help my grandmother. Please say the children were scattered in the house crying. There was a marijuana bomb in the house with them. Shelby police arrived just before the mother, 32 year old Dewana Lee, got home. She drove the Acura parked beside the house today. An officer said, she was so drunk, she crawled out of the car and pulled herself up onto her feet. I found an open container of alcohol, actually two, open, two containers of alcohol in her, in her vehicle. They said they found cocaine in her purse when they got to the jail. Police said their first concern was getting the children handed over to their grandmother. Then they became worried. Well, that's the scary part is, is, is what actually was going on uh, that we don't know about. What actually happened at that house before we were ever involved. He says social workers are now asking those same questions. Neighbors were hesitant to speak on camera, but one did tell me he didn't even know there were six children at that house. Live in Shelby, I'm Ken Lemon, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. Ken, thank you. These stories are really hard to hear about, but we're grateful those kids are safe now.